A typical company probably doesn't necessarily care whether or not their products are used in the right way or actually solving problems as long as they're selling. And that's not Hagee. We want to create solutions that actually go out and make a difference. Hagee being a 68-year-old company, I think we've been thought of as a sprayer company for a lot of that period of time because we built the world's first self-propelled sprayer. Today, we think of ourselves as an applications company. We want to be involved in all things application. We want to become more involved in the things that happen on the farm. I'm a producer myself, and there are a lot of people in this company that have agricultural backgrounds. So I think it starts with having a stronger passion for our purpose than most of our competitors. And it also goes back to our ability to, to listen and be willing to admit that we don't know everything and be able to go to the market and ask a lot of questions. I look at our culture as a high-performing, highly engaged type workforce. I want people to wake up to a purpose, you know, not an alarm clock. I want people to want to be here. A lot of companies will say that the customer is number one, and I think we've said that. But one thing that I realized is that if you say that the customer is number one, that customer can never get served to the level that they need to. I believe you have to put the employees first, because if you don't, they'll never take care of the customer. Being a factory direct company, I think it allows us to, to stay that one step closer to our customers. And if there's ever an issue, we don't have layers to get through. Our, our team here knows exactly what the issue is and they can solve the problem for that customer immediately. I think heating manufacturing brings more passion to the industry. And with that passion, brings the, the problem solving that uh, the industry needs. I see more potential in our future today than I've ever seen. You go back to the culture of this company and the people that we have in place and the, the amount of effort we put towards understanding the market and the challenges that, that market has, we have a lot to bring to the table and I think that over the next few years, Higgy is going to be bringing many, many more great products to the market that are going to have huge impacts to the future of agriculture.